Hello! Welcome back to Read It Reviews. I have my March wrap-up video. I forgot what month just passed, but wait, no, it wasn't even March, it was April. I don't know what's going on, but I have my puppy with me. This is Harley. He's my baby. Right, Harley? Yes, you know. Okay, so anyways, I didn't have a very great reading month. I usually aim for eight books. I got through six this month. And first I read Shadow Kiss by Michelle Mead, which is the third book in the Vampire Academy series. I gave this book five stars, I believe. I love the series a lot. Rose and Dimitri, probably two of my favorite characters of all time. And they're adorable, and I love them. <laughs> but anyways. And then I read The Forest of Hands and Teeth by Carrie Ryan. I only gave this two stars. I didn't like it. No. I was expecting it to be really good. I picked it up, and it was okay the first few chapters, but I just couldn't get into it. It just bored me to death. But I finished it. <laughs> so, and then after that, when I thought, well, this book kind of ruined my reading mood for a while, but after that, I picked up um, Thou Shalt Not Road Trip by Anthony John from the library, which is why I don't have it. And I loved it. I mean, wasn't really... Well, I love books about road trips because travel is like one of my favorite things, so I was really excited about it. I seen it in Barnes & Noble like the day before I got it at the library and I almost bought it. But I'm like, nah, I got something else instead. So when I seen it at the library, I was like, okay, I might as well get it and check it out. And then I had time to kill, so I sat there and read a few pages of it, and then it turned into sitting there and reading about 90 pages of it. So I checked it out and then finished it like when I got home. And I liked it a lot. So yeah, thou shalt not road trip. And then... After Thou Shalt Not Road Trip, I read Divergent by Veronica Roth, which I was really behind on reading, but I got to it this month and I loved it so much. I love it. And it smells good. But anyways, yes, I love it. And Insurgent came out three days ago, is it the fourth? I don't know. But I already bought it. I'm almost done, which you'll see in my May. It's not freaking May. Wait, yeah, it is. It's May. Oh my god, I have no idea what's going on. In my May, uh, to be read video. I mean, I pretty much have already read the whole thing, but I'm still gonna show it in the video. And I'm going to a Veronica Roth signing tonight and getting Insurgent signed. I already have this signed from when it first came out, see? So yeah. Oh yeah, and that has five stars, of course. And then I read Stay by Deb Coletti. Um, I gave this four stars. I liked it a lot. It was a quick read, and I liked the characters of Clara and her dad. They were funny through most of the book. There was just something missing. I don't know. After I was done with it, I was like, that was good, but it wasn't terribly amazing. Terribly amazing. Uh, it was amazing. <laughs> That's what I'm trying to get at, but it was good. And then, the last book I read in April, I almost forgot again, 
was The Goddess Test by Amy Carter. And I gave this book five stars because I loved it. I wasn't expecting to love it because I heard, like, some pretty crappy reviews from quite a few people on YouTube and Goodreads. And some were pretty good. But once I got into it, I just fell in love with the characters. At first I was like, this is kind of stupid and, I don't know, I mean the whole Eva hitting her head and then tall, mysterious guy in black comes out of nowhere and says, oh, bring her back to life if you come and live with me. And I'm like, yeah, this is kind of stupid. But I kept reading and I love Kate. She's a good female character, not stupid and whiny like a lot of them these days. And Henry was okay, but like characters like James and Ava and of course Kate just made the book and I loved it a lot. And went out and picked up the next one, like, right away before I even finished this one. So yeah, that was my reading lunch for... Munch? Did I say munch? <laughs> I've been drinking Starbucks before I shot this video, so yeah. I obviously meant month. Reading month. <laughs> um, um, um. I don't even know what I was saying anymore, but I'm gonna shoot my a May uh, to be read right after this, so yeah. Um, if you're still watching this, thank you for putting up with me. I'm really hyper right now. Oh, Harley wants to say bye. Look, oh, say bye, Harley. Bye. Oh, what are you doing? Okay, bye.